Nick from California Tiny House here on another tiny house tour. Today we've got one of the coolest houses I think we've shown to date. What we're looking at today is a 10 by 28 plus seven. Yeah, it's another gooseneck. So the exterior of this house is cool. It's our board and bat, marine plywood with an accent of light gray metal. Now the best part about it is this center section right here overlooking these big windows and doors where these are solid pieces that go all the way up and seamlessly go to the peak. Coming through the gooseneck section, still have the same board and bat and then we've just got this little accent that we added here on the front. And we're going under, follow me guys. We've got our mini split on the front here. You can see that roof just kind of comes all the way from the peak and spills all the way down. So what's cool about this house, it's got two bedrooms, both of which have staircases. Both staircases have storage in them. It's got an awesome kitchen, custom vanity in the bathroom, tile shower, and the showstopper, I mean, besides just all the natural light pouring in through all these huge windows, is this 10 foot wide, bifold, trifold, movable glass wall, call it what you want. It, it, when I open this thing up later, it, I mean, it's just amazing. Let's open it up now. Oh, well, I guess we could open it up now. Two small handles. Let me give you guys kind of the vision of where this house is getting placed. So it sits up, you know, kind of on a knoll, and this overlooks the rest of the property. So this has this, you know, kind of theater style view almost. You're not going to see this very often in a tiny house. One, these things are crazy heavy require a lot of engineering to actually make them work. But man, when you get them right, it is sweet. Into the bathroom, you know, it's a tiny house bathroom, of course, but is it tiny? No, not really. I mean, I'm six and a half feet tall. I feel very comfortable in this space. Even for a guy my size, the shower's, the shower's nice and big. Um, you know, I can wash my hair. It's got the dual dual shower heads, which is cool. We always love doing that. And the one, you know, slides on the pole. Soap dispenser, inst valve instructions. I mean, to turn on a faucet, it's like on and off, right? Yeah. I'm not gonna open it because there's probably water in the lines, but. No, it's, <laughs> Okay, so yeah, bathroom. Standard flush toilet. Yeah, standard flush toilet, fan, window. Lots of good space. I like this bathroom, it's nice. What we wanted in this house is we didn't want just a your, your basic vanity with a solid wall. You know, with this bathroom door open, having a vanity that's got this open style with the vessel top sink even, and you know, the, the big tall faucet, you can see all through, you know, through the door. And it's a really cool thing. Plus from the inside of the bathroom, it feels a little bit more open, not having something that's so big and bulky and solid. So yeah, that's why we love to do these styles. Staircase, storage, coming up. Can you, come on, come on, you can fit. Come on, come up here with me. Coming up onto the, the landing of the secondary bedroom or primary bedroom, either way. There's a closet that we built. This actually is the end of the trailer. So this is all bonus space, I guess, if you want to consider it that. But any way we can pick up a little bit of extra storage works great. Then behind me here, you've got some hanging closet storage and then a nice big loft bedroom for up to a queen size bed. What's cool about this loft is really on, on all four sides, it's very open. You've got either natural light pouring through from the window on either of the two sides. You've got this cool open beam look that kind of spans the entire length of the house. And then right here where I'm at, you've got the space for the closet. So it all feels kind of, makes a smaller space feel kind of large. 
So the, the kitchen's really bright and open, all the natural light pouring in. There's these two pass-through windows for, you wanna set something outside, someone's gonna grab it, you're gonna set it up on the table. It was designed exactly for that reason. Space to eat, workspace, whatever you wanna do here. Six foot table though, it's, it's big. Oh, smooshed the mic on my, my neck. Custom bar top, so all butcher block here. And then we have these steel legs specialty made. Um, I mean, you can buy them, but we don't because we like to make stuff. <laughs> they go with the so the materials in the kitchen are, are very modern and sleek. You've got stainless steel and smooth top appliances, you know, very neutral tone granite and, ca um, and cabinets, white tile, but we bring in elements of wood to give it kind of a softer feeling and also to warm the whole space up. You know, having the natural light coming in helps with that as well. Raised elevated gooseneck bedroom, not loft, which could very well be your master. And, or you could choose the, uh, the, the regular loft bedroom. And this could be a nursery. It could be a kid's bedroom, an office. It could be whatever you want it to be. And what's neat is it actually shares the back wall of the kitchen, which had some building elements for ventilation and uh, a bunch of stuff I won't get into. But uh, up the stairs, more storage, drawers all the way down. The, the main bedroom or bonus room, the space that we're in now, guys can fit a king size bed cow king or smaller so obviously queen or anything else got good size closet here oops and yes of course these things open down here as well N nowhere where you're nowhere inside the house do you ever feel like you're in an uncomfortable spot and which is hard to do in a tiny house guys it's design is everything so you know having a space like this it feels very comfortable big and open and airy it's it's difficult but man when it comes together it's it's cool i do love this house love the the light coming through the the colors as you even look at this floor take take a look at this floor if you haven't um, yeah, extra wide plank, um, nine inches wide, I think. B nice big bar for eating, granite countertops, farmhouse sink. Um, this, obviously this door is just insane. This door is crazy, guys. I wish, I wish you were here to see how big this thing is. I mean, I mean, it's, it's incredible. Coming to the back of the house, this is that, it's all additional. This is built onto the back of the trailer. It has the closet up here. Remember that closet next to the landing? That sits right there. And underneath we use the space for outdoor garage space. Throw your tools in here. It's got lights. And it's got this door. Well, the door's heavy. Big door. I mean, look at the size of this door. Ah, that's a door. <laughs> no house would be complete without the outdoor shower, all done in the same steel as the siding. Um, we've got a few things to do here, guys. We're adding lights here as well, more plywood, and then we gotta put those big, you know, heavy duty doors on. Stainless steel pan, pretty cool. You can be out here, curtain or no curtain, to each his own, showering it up. Thanks for watching this video. Please like and subscribe. Um, comment and other stuff too, please. We like, <laughs> would you comment? <laughs> Comments or not, likes or dislikes. We're, we're gonna keep making videos because it's fun for us and uh, me and my brother get to hang out. But seriously, like it and subscribe it, please.
means everything. <laughs> it does. It does give us validation. Th this was a cool house, though. I really hope if you didn't like the video, I hope you at least like the house. Um, you'll see more pictures of it on Instagram coming up here or you before this. Yeah. But yeah, um, thanks. Thanks for watching, guys. We really do appreciate it. We really do. Tell you what, th this door is like seriously cool though. It would be easier if there was a patio out here right now. No, it wasn't too strong. It was, you know, it was strong. There's no argument there. Oh man, you know, this is a cool house. This is like a cool house. I really like this one.